More than 1,000 residents of Mitero and Bondeni villages in Kieni constituency in Yeri County have had their homes connected to power after living in darkness for as long as they can remember. The power connectivity project being carried out by the Rural Electrification and Renewable Energy Corporation, RERC, aims to have every household connected to electricity through the Last Mile project. Mwangi Miner reports from Nyeri. After living in darkness for as long as they can remember, residents of Metero and Bodeni villages in Kenny constituency of Nyeri County can now smile after electric power was connected to their homes, courtesy of Rural Electrification and Renewable Energy Corporation, RIREC. Residents now say that they will use this golden opportunity to boost their socio-economic activities such as farming now that they are connected to power. <laughs> Speaking after launching the power connectivity in the two villages, chairman of the RIREC Board of Directors, Professor Simon Gisharu, has challenged beneficiaries to make good use of the power they have been yearning for. Professor Gesharu said the project will improve students' performance as their studies now won't be interrupted because of lack of power. Vijana wetu hawa kidogo. Wakipewa homework. Sisi tukisoma na kubuka. Tulikuwa tunatumia ile kata kidogo ya mafuta. Wakati ile hakuna hiyo mafuta, hatukuwa tunasoma homework. Tunataka kusikia improvement ya education area hii kwa sababu watoto wetu wamepata skill. Professor Gisharu has also put on notice those who might be intending to vandalize the transformers and other amenities as provided by Rerek. Gisharu has asked community members to guard the project zealously as it belongs to them. Iko watu wana vandalize transformers. Tunawaitanga na kikuyu karea nime. Yule mutu abaye anakula ile mutu mwingine amerima. Kwa hivyo hao, mukiwaona hao, Mufukuze, sawa sawa. Na tutaki kusikia hii transformer, tukizidua hii muladi, tunataka kusikia inaendelea kumusaidia. While speaking at the ceremony, Kenny Member of Parliament Kanini Kega has held RIREC for this project, saying that it will open the area as well as spur economic growth of the region. Kanini says by 2013, only 16 out of 100 people had power connected to their homes, but the number has soared up to 50 people in every 100 connected to the grid. Apart from the bulb, apart from the lighting in the houses that we are doing all over the country, we have had industrious young men in our local village, you know, doing the basic welding, you know, doing farming, getting that shaft cutter that now was done manually, now is going to be done uh, through uh, um, electric power. That is the kind of transformation that we are talking about. Happy for the women because uh, they will be empowered from what I've just cut, uh, cut from the women, they will be putting a lot of businesses, incubators, so that they will have and chicken and from there eggs and they will be able to sell. It is also very interesting that once we have this connectivity, our women will feel secured. Also, the Rural Electrification and Renewable Energy Corporation launched their Moega stores, which will be instrumental in, in storing and distributing materials necessary for power connectivity. The Moega stores will double up as RIREC offices serving the larger Mount Kenya counties, northeastern and parts of Central Rift. As the country continues to make advancements toward the realization of Vision 2030, the demand for energy continues to increase. At the same time, I'm happy to mention that by the end of June this year, that is 2021, the corporation will have completed a total of another 20 projects that are currently at different stages of completion within Nyeri County. The corporation is currently undertaking 20 projects in Nyeri County and upon completion, more than 5,000 Nyeri County residents will stand to gain from the power connectivity.
The commissioning of this warehouse will ease up the decentralization and distribution of electrification materials, not only in Nyeri County and the larger Mount Kenya counties, but also to the neighboring counties. Also, this warehouse will provide employment opportunities to the locals in this region. Mwangi Maina, TV47 from Wega, Nyeri County.